The Fayetteville woman accused of killing and dismembering two of her adoptive children was supposed to face a judge today, but it never happened. Thanks for joining us. I'm Liz Ortiz. And I'm Russ Bowen. Now the biological families of Blake and London Devon will have to wait until at least next month to see what happens next. CBS 17's Haley Fixler is live outside the Devon home on Barrydale Drive. Haley, what's the latest? Well, I want to show you this new memorial that's been put up right outside of the home. You can see these flowers and these crosses there. Neighbors put it up this afternoon. They say they just want to do whatever they can to show support for the family as they continue to wait for answers and for justice. Two brightly colored crosses flanked by bouquets of flowers sit at the corner of what investigators say was a house of horrors in Fayetteville. Blake and London Devon, originally named Trenton and Mariah, are believed to have been killed by their adoptive mother, Avante Devon. In June, investigators charged her with seven felonies, including two counts of first-degree murder, felony child abuse, concealing death and bodily remains, and kidnapping. Officials say they were given little to no food, beaten to the point of needing medical care, and were kept in small, dark rooms. Blake was last seen in 2017, when he would have been around 11 years old. London, last spotted in 2019. Officers say that while she was an adult, she had special needs and depended on Devin to take care of her. Investigators report Devin convinced another person inside of the home to dismember their bodies. Their remains were found in metal burn barrels. On Tuesday, the biological mothers of Blake and Devon posting this photo from outside of the Berrydale Drive home, where investigators believe a lot of the abuse happened and where they think London was killed. The moms bearing these signs, asking for justice for their children. And we do know the State Department of Health and Human Services is investigating how Devin was able to adopt five children from across the state. We also are working to find out whether or not Devin received adoption assistance funds after Blake and London were killed. She is next to set to be in court in August. Live in Fayetteville, Haley Fixler, CBS 17 News. All right, Haley, thank you.